I'm going to show you how to connect Commissions Inc. and Call Action using a Zapier integration. So we've already connected our uh, Call Action account using basically a Zapier connection. Uh, so this is really easy. You're going to need to log into Call Action, get your API key, and connect that specific account. Next, we're going to go into Commissions Inc select that and we're going to select the add lead option here so once we do add lead option we're going to go ahead and continue and now we're going to do a test account so we're connecting the account making sure everything looks okay we continue forward and now we're going to set up the form that is going to create the leads from call action the captured phone calls and text messages directly into commissions inc so first thing here you're going to go and you're going to start to select all of the available fields so we're going to map the original field so cell phone to cell phone we're doing first name to first name we're going to do uh, names basically first name and then we're going to do last name and then in here we already have an email so we're going to drop the email that comes in now as far as the rest of these are concerned you can leave most of these off uh, Assigned agent, you have an option here to pick a specific agent. Uh, and then you also have the ability to pick a label. This is basically your tagging options that you have within the system. So if you wanted to see tags, you would be able to see those tags that way. You can determine if it's a buyer lead since in call action, you're using specific phone numbers for specific lead sources. You can start to map a lot of these things directly. You can decide if you want the lead to go lead routing or not. Uh, one use case for this might be on our text tool if you're distributing leads and you want to use lead routing. And then next, what you want to do here in the notes section, you want to get all of the data from call action. So as we do our reverse data append on that lead, you're going to pick notes and you're going to merge that note in. Now, as you kind of continue down, you can go into source here what I recommend is you call it call action and then you can merge in your campaign name from call action so that that is basically carried over you can also do that here in your labels if you want to apply a specific label um, and you already have a match that would basically be it now you're gonna hit continue this is gonna do a sample test you hit continue again and now basically the account is complete you turn this on and now your lead is going to be synced directly into your CRM now what we can also do is we can create a secondary zap so we're going to go back into here and now we're going to do this with call action using a, a, a new activity so we're going to name this call uh, sync new activity so sync new activity and this particular part this is going to update all of the leads that you have within call action and you're going to go ahead and be able to see every call every text message as it's basically continuing forward so now we've connected the account you're going to hit the next step move to the next action and now you're going to do it as an add note so you're going to connect add note hit continue Again, you're going to test the account, make sure we get a success here, move that forward. And now all you have to do is just two fields to map up. So the first one is going to be the contact email. So you want to match email to email. And then in the body, what we like to put is the type of message that it is. Hit two spaces to give you some spacing and then hit the body. And this is going to merge in all of the activity from call action directly into your commission zinc. You're going to go ahead and hit save and now basically hit a test account directly in there if you get this particular error because there's no uh, matching email that's fine go ahead and hit skip and now basically you have connected your account turn that basically on and you are ready to go